Yo, Retro here and today I'll be showing you how to do long shadow effect in the Photoshop CC. So for this you'll need Photoshop CS6 extended or CC. It's got the 3D version here. If you do not have this you cannot do it. So first of all just create a empty project and then I'm just going to quickly create this. So now you want to put some text or shapes or whatever you want. Should put a center point. Something like that. Color overlay. I just have this and so you have this just rasterize this then select the layer you want to put into 3D click on 3D new 3D extrusion from selected layer and it will switch you to 3D mode and now what you want to do is click here and it will swap main and secondary view so this is the top view and if you have a shape then I don't know like this then it's all right oh, got a square and this is a infinity light right here so you want to select that and then drag it how you want the shadow to be in this case I want it something like this and as you can see it fades out as well so once that's done you want to click this button right here which starts to render it out So I'll be back once that's done. So once it's finished rendering, you can switch back to layers and just click on this. And as you can see, it's rendered out. And as you can see, this is a different color. So if you want it to go normal, go back to this, click on 3D, on rectangle, or whatever shape, or what you created, click on the first one. And as you see, you got material diffuse, so change that to where it was. And specular, change that to what it was. Illumination, diffuse, like this. Render out again, and once you change the color, it should be like this. You can see you got the shadow right here, and then basically you can do the same thing with all the other ones. You just have to change material on the side which you want. 
and then render it out. So yeah, thanks for watching, hope you enjoyed this tutorial, see ya.